I'm so happy. You know, Mustang. Today Woo! we're going to where are we going? Cape Cod and guess yes. where I got? We got a, a rental. Yes. We got yeah. a convertible rental, so that's gonna be so exciting. I'm gonna obviously film with the top down. It's gonna be so fun. I'm super excited. It's both of our first times going to Cape Cod. I'm really excited about that. We're gonna see everything and have a, an amazing time. I'm gonna do an outfit of the day really quickly. Outfit of the day. So this is I think Macy's. Macy's uh, shorts. And my little Disney crop. And then my and top is from Amazon. For the, for the Bottoms are Levi's and <coughs> have my Disney Crocs. Yay! So we'll see you guys um, outside and I'll show you guys the convertible. Made it to the car and look, we have a red convertible Mustang. Look how cool the little um, horse is at the bottom. So excited! In case y'all wanted to know, my mom did wake up early. You woke up mom right. The bomb. Yeah, you woke up right at like 7:50 to I get there at want, eight for opening. I was not even awake. Yeah, so they I was talking to these guys. I looked like I was asleep. But we woke up early because she wanted to see if she could get a convertible, and they let us. Look how nice the interior is. I'm so excited. I know I said that already, but. Um, we're in like the Orleans part of Cape Cod, but we're going all the way down to province province town Yeah, and that's all the way at the tip of Cape Cod So that's gonna take us another maybe like 30 minutes to get there But we did just eat at this place called the land Ho. I'll insert some photos now I didn't film in there because there's just a bunch of people, but the food was really good It was like I don't know. It was a cute little quaint area. How did you like it? Very very I liked it a lot the food was delicious. I had some yeah, you had the, mm -hmm. and it was very quaint, very little, like um, sea town, you know, beach town. Yeah, with like lots of people, lots of tourists. I had a turkey sandwich. I went out of my comfort zone and got a sandwich, and that honestly, that wasn't that bad. I'm pretty full. The fries at first, I didn't really like them, but they were good. <laughs> um, so yeah, right now I think we're gonna go. We're driving to Provincetown, but we're gonna go stop at like a little beach. I don't know, I Macaroni Beach or something or McCorney. McCorney. McCorney Beach. I kept calling it Macaroni, but we're going to McCorney Beach, so obviously I'll film that when we get there. And we made it to the beach. <laughs> I just wanna note really quickly this is not McCorney Beach. Um, this is just a random beach that we found. What is it called? Nosset Beach? Nosset Beach. Nosset Beach. We're going to McCorney Beach later after. Where's the dog? Where? Where do you see the dog? thinking about? Oh my gosh, can you see it? Can you guys see the dog? <laughs> guys, look how pretty this is. I literally feel like I'm on a set of a movie, like I'm in a movie. Guys, look how cool this rock is. It's so pretty. I'm so happy. Like, you guys don't understand. It's so nice here. Waves crashing down on the rocks. It's such a beautiful sound. So different from Miami Beach. And I love it. Yeah, look at Mama Born. There, taking photos. How are you feeling? Are you happy? I'm super happy. You made it. I know. And this is only one of a couple beaches we're gonna visit. Yes, yes, we have like at least two more to see. It's so pretty. Well. We'll stay here for another 10 minutes. We made it to our second beach. We made it to Macaroni Beach um, or Macaroni Beach. I'm gonna call it Macaroni Beach. But we made it. Close. Look, this looks like we're like 
Dobby died. Does it not? <laughs> like, I literally, I feel like I'm in Harry Potter. Dobby. This, Dobby this one's a little bit more blue. Dobby I don't know if you could see Potter. the water. Okay, so we're finally laying down. We found a little spot. We got our blanket and all our Crocs and everything um, holding it down. But this beach, Macaroni Beach, is a lot more crowded than the other one we were in. I forgot what it was called, Nanset Beach. And there's surfers, like I said earlier. Look at the surfers out there. The rad. But yeah, we're just chilling. We're probably going to be here for a little longer. I don't know what we're going to do next. Tell the vlog how you feel about... <laughs> Um, Macaroni Beach versus Nasset Beach. Which one's better? I like uh, Nasset Beach. Appears to be more like it, pure, like more quaint. Yeah, pure quaint. This, this is definitely is more, more touristy. Like then it has beaches. I mean, uh, waves. surfers. I really want to start going live on YouTube, but obviously, um, to go live, I think you need like a thousand followers or something just want to go live because we love watching YouTube lives and we would love to okay, do that too and go to Disney and stuff. On, oh, on, on TikTok. TikTok. We can go live on TikTok though because guess what? This girl yes, has... I'm, I went viral a few months back. We can't because there's no freaking so, internet. Oh, that's right. Oh, that's one Holy thing about cow. these beaches is they're literally like, there's no reception at all. So if you're planning on coming here and you're planning on calling your friends are going on TikTok or Instagram, you can't. You, you can't. can't. Just, just, just you give, give up give up that idea. I um, mean, I wish I would have known that. Maybe some vlogger could have said that before. Well, guess what? The, here, well, we here, are. here we are. Here the we are. Crazy Disney dude is telling you. Pro tip, if you come next to the ocean, then you'll get service because Mama Bore now has service. Look how beautiful this is. Uh, oh my gosh. Miami never. Also, just wanted to mention a bunch of dogs at like these beaches like dogs are allowed at the I'm, beaches I'm the yeah she's in she's Earth. in heaven i'm in heaven i have seen like, like there's a dog like over there eight or nine dogs just there's some over there we could have brought bb here i could live here just because they are dog lovers i love it we're leaving the beach now but just wanted to let you guys know they do have showers and bathrooms so if you're all full of sand like we are you could definitely use it is it it's cold about 42 degrees at least, at least there's water. Oh my god. <laughs> We're leaving Macaroni Beach, like I just said earlier. I think I said that in the last clip, but we are going now to Provincetown, our final destination. That's where we've been going, but you know, we've been stopping at these little beaches. And I think that area has like all the little like shops and everything. So super excited about that. We made it to Provincetown, but one thing to know, um, it's very hard to park. Like we're a little confused. Oh my gosh! We don't know. We don't know what we're doing. Honestly, we're driving, trying to find no, parking. No, no, but no, look no, at. No, but you know what? Look at all of these houses. Everything is so pretty. This um, Provincetown definitely reminds me more of Key West than like the rest of Cape Cod where we've been. Oh my gosh! So I definitely love this more because I love Key West and I love the quaint style. So. I don't know, I'm obsessed. I think my hair's crazy right now, but we made it to our last beach of the day in <laughs> Provincetown. I know we were just in the little like Provincetown area, but we're planning on coming to the beach now that it's daytime and then going back more towards nighttime because like there's a big nightlife there. So we're gonna walk around the street at night. I'm gonna try to film as much as I can for you guys. We're doing a Mustang photo shoot. <laughs> Thank you to Provincetown Beach for having a walkway. The other beaches didn't really have anything like that and it was super hard. It was literally like a workout. But look how nice. This also kind of looks like where Dobby died. Rest in peace, Dobby. Definitely not as crowded as Macaroni Beach. Every beach I somehow wet my pants. Oh my gosh. But look at this. Doesn't it literally look like a castle? I swear, all of these beaches remind me of movies. It's so crazy. Oh I feel like I'm not even in America. Guys, I want to move to Boston so bad. Would you move to Boston? Uh, no, I wouldn't. You wouldn't move to Boston? It's Montreal because it's cold. Like, like Boston, cold. No, I'd rather come in vacation. Guys, so we're done with the beach now. We're finally going into Provincetown again and going to have a girls' night. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah, girls night. Um, I did change because my pants. It's not just a girls' night. I yeah. Um, I did change because 
my pants got super wet at the beach right now so I put on a little skirt I don't know if you could see it so a OTD the skirt is from Amazon in case if any of you guys wanted to know I hope that we get something to eat because I'm, I'm feeling a little hungry or just like even an ice cream or something I just want a little snack so hopefully we can do that so we got ice cream hot cookie dough and what are these gummy bears and what did you get chocolate ice cream with caramel heat let me see Yummy. We got it at this place over here, Lewis Brothers Homemade Ice Cream. It's right next to like an airbrush tattoo place and a hot dog place. In case, if you ever come here and you want to check it out, you know? But it's really good. I love cookie dough ice cream. So I highly recommend. Somehow we're back at the ocean. <laughs> There's like a little strip over here that um leads us to the ocean. We literally are Moana. It calls us. How pretty this is. It looks like New Orleans. This whole strip just has a bunch of like stores. There's a vintage store over there, but it's closed. I wish we could have gone. They also have homemade cookies here, which I kind of want, but I just had ice cream, so <laughs> maybe we'll get some and take them home. We ended up getting something. Like I was saying, we did end up getting something. We got a snickerdoodle, and what did you get? A Kong <laughs> Yeah, we'll show you guys when we get back to the hotel. But we're not gonna eat it now, we're gonna wait till later. So we made it to a restaurant called Patio. Here's the um, menu if you want it, if you can like scan. It's super nice here, I won't like show a lot of it, but I just don't want to get other people in it. The drink, I'm gonna get a wild passion. And to eat, I'm gonna get the patio tacos with the steak. You can't really see it because my camera is not focusing for some reason. But it has Napa cabbage, tomatoes, avocado, cilantro, salsa, verde, and mixed green really quickly I just want to say the people here are literally so so nice and I don't mean the waiters like the waiters are nice here but just the people in general like literally we were taking a selfie and this family came up to us and was like oh my gosh you guys are so cute do you want me to take a photo of you they were doing like a whole photo shoot it was so nice and really thoughtful and I don't know everyone was just so sweet and I'll let my mom tell another story about a dog um it was just so cute. This is my mom's story that I said she was gonna tell. She's been freaking out about all the dogs because literally everyone has a dog here. So she saw a dog and she was like, oh my gosh, I just want to say hi to a dog. But I didn't say it, I said it but to her and then this guy walked by and he saw me. And he's like, and he's do like, you want to say hi to my dog? He's like, I can see that you want to and I'm like, Oh my gosh, she's like, would love that. And then I did, but the little, the little doggy didn't care for me so much. So, but that's okay. We talked to the daddy and he was fine. Yeah. And he was super, super nice. He gave a whole story about him running and how, like, he ran. <laughs> <laughs> about how right. he always looks at dogs and then yeah. his friend left him because like, and he's like he was dragging her behind he's like, oh, bye. <laughs> oh my god so yeah everybody is nice in this place like this is just like yeah, happy town our drinks came i this is the wild passion and what did you get uh um a beer from me. A pumpkin beer. Try it. Tell me how you like it. Cheers. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Cheers. Oh I just gosh. spilled. I just spilled my drink. Oh my god! This is a green black and white. Mr. Tomorrow. These are my steak tacos. They literally look amazing, <laughs> and they're huge. And I got a mixed salad too. And we got a set of fries. And what's this? The lobster roll and a little coleslaw. Yeah, the lobster roll and coleslaw. Delicioso. Okay, guys. So we finished eating. My tacos were amazing. The steak was absolutely. Sorry, the waiter came. But like I was saying, the steak was amazing. We got a side of fries. The fries were really, really, really good. I like them better than the fries that we had earlier at the restaurant. What restaurant did we go to? Land Co or something? Something like that. How was, how was your food? My food was absolutely stunning, delicious, amazing. Typical Cape Cod um, lobster roll. That's just lobster roll, all the best. We also bought stuff. Oh, sorry, I cut you off. <laughs> we also bought stuff at the store. It's literally like right over there. Um, and we're gonna do a haul when we get back to the hotel room. Yeah. And we have to go now because we need our room. Table. Our table. Yeah, it was easy. <laughs> we need our room. Hey guys, you probably can't see us um, like at all. It's super dark. But before we get to the car, 
because I probably won't film in the car anymore um, because I'm gonna probably nap. I just wanted to say that today was absolutely like, it was delicious. amazing. She keeps saying delicious about everything. But today was absolutely amazing. We're back in the hotel room and I'm sorry, I think like the camera cut off right when I was saying how much um, like how happy I was and how much I loved today even though I think it was for the best because it was super dark you probably couldn't see me anyways um, but my battery died so that's why the camera cut off but we're back home at the hotel it's 1254 so almost 1 a.m. Okay. I'm tired yeah it was amazing it was super fun um, even just the drive back home or back to the hotel, I keep saying back home. Back to the hotel, it was really great. Um, I am going to do the haul. I'm probably going to do that tomorrow morning because we got to go. Or, you know what? She just got the clothes out. I'll do the haul for the clothes right now. So what I got, I got these sweatpants. It says Provincetown, Massachusetts. I picked Provincetown instead of Cape Cod because I just really like Provincetown. Everyone is so nice there and I just thought it was amazing. So that's why I picked those instead of like Cape Cod ones. But I did get a Cape Cod like sweater, green sweater. It kind of reminds me of like Hogwarts or something. It says Cape Cod, Massachusetts with a ship on it. And then we got Cape Cod, Massachusetts sweater for my brother's girlfriend and my mom got Cape Cod sweatpants. I hope you guys like that little haul. Like I said earlier, today was absolutely amazing and I'm so happy that I got to experience all of these things, especially with Mama Born because she's always the best. You know, girls trip, girls trip vibes, but I'm super exhausted and I'm excited to go to sleep. I think that we're so lucky to be able to do this. It's I want to cry. Hey guys, good morning. Today we're just going to the Friendly Toast, probably to eat. And then we're going to go shopping, we're going to go to Zara and Urban Outfitters. And then we're leaving. We made it to the Friendly Toast. If you want to scan the menu, here it is, so you can check it out. Our food came, I got the chicken and waffles, and I also got a pineapple juice. And what did you get? The, I don't know what that is, but it looks delicious. Okay, so we're pretty much done eating, and how did you like your food? Delicious. <laughs> Delicious is the word of the week. It was scrumptious, delicious, yes. amazing, black and white. And tomorrow. my food was really good too. It's a little spicy, but I asked for the um, hot honey on the side, which definitely made it less spicy. I'm a very um, spice sensitive person, so it was a little, little too much. We're in the room now. We ended up going to Urban Outfitters. I couldn't find anything except a shirt. That was too small, so we ordered a medium online, and it's going to be shipped to the house, but we've pretty much been packing everything. You can see there's like a bunch of stuff. We're trying to figure out what rocks to bring. We're going to go to Boston Commons and to see the Edgar Allan Poe like statue. And come back to the hotel, call an Uber, and sadly go to the airport. Uh, I had an amazing time on this trip. And I'm just, I'm so happy that we were able to come. We made it. We made it outside, but um, it's raining and my umbrella broke. <laughs> but look, Edgar Allan Poe's there. Yay. <laughs> um, we made it to the park. We're in public garden. As you can see, there's pretty much no one because it's raining. Um, but it's still pretty and we had to come here one more time because I don't know, we absolutely, we, we love Public Garden, I love Public Garden, it's what absolutely pretty. We're singing in the rain, singing in the rain, what a glorious feeling, I'm handed again, yeah, our Broadway queen. <laughs> Look how much it's raining, oh my god. This is literally insane. I feel like I'm in Miami. Hey guys, it's been a couple of days. We've been back from Boston. We've just been really busy, but we're finally, finally filming the outro. Everything at the airport went fine. At first, our seats were away from each other, but then they fixed it and, and we got I to sit next to each magic. other. Yep. Um, we played games. You played solitaire. She almost won. But everything was... We watched movies. Yeah. We had some drinks. It was lovely. Oh, yeah. She got a drink. It was very Fancy. fun. 
so yeah everything at the airport was great and the whole process went by smoothie there was like no one there compared to miami airport there was really no one we didn't even have to wait for tsa but it was very easy yeah. but that's all we just want to say thank you so much for watching our very first vlog thank soon you, there's gonna be you. disney vlogs Many we're going to, to come to yeah we're them. going to happily ever after the first return of it. it so like comment and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and that crazy disney duo out bye guys bye, bye.